Hi, D. Baca Maker here, and today I'm going to be making a vice stand. I'm making it out of four pieces of 4x4, four four, nominal, that's 3.5x3.5 uh, inch actual uh, pine. I've already cut three of these legs to the length that I want, which is 32 inches, on my saw. I'm just now about to cut the next one, the last one. 32 here. And this saw has a tendency ow, to, uh, one of the legs bit me, to wander. The blade wanders when I'm cutting. So I'm going to give myself a couple of reference spaces here so that if it does wander while I'm cutting, I can clean it up at the belt sander or with a plane. So let's get to cutting. And of course, I'm cutting outside of the kerf, so I have to line up the teeth on the, the line just fine. Yeah, pencil mark is still square, still square. The blade is square. That's a rare thing. Is the base for my vice stand, or the pedestal for my vice stand. It's substantial, it's heavy, but it'll do the job. Now, to make an appropriate base. putting this together I discovered that there was a check running all the way through here so when I get all of this done I'm going to come back with some glue just to finish off the look or cut these off to match don't know
this is a Harbor Freight purchase, but it's not too bad. I mean, it's got some problems. It's very stiff right now on this action. And I've cleaned this off several times, so that means that there's some thing inside here that's just slowing down, but eventually that'll just wear out. I also have to put some smooth-faced jaw, uh, jaws in here. Can't just uh, grind these down because they're not countersunk enough. I'll probably just put some jaw inserts. And so, that is the vice stand. It's not a super impressive piece of work. I needed to get it done fairly rapidly. Uh, but it works. I mean, it's stable and it does the job. Despite the fact that the wood that I used was had been weathered severely for many months out in this backyard. So I'm going to have to come back and revisit the base of the stand at the very least and probably make it out of something round that I can roll. I don't know if it's going to be just a simple sheet of metal or if I'm going to find a ring, an old umbrella stand, not a new one, because the metal is too thin on those, an old umbrella stand, something of that nature so that I could mount the unit onto the stand and be able to roll it around rather than have to pick it up and move it. But if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Like, comment, and uh, share. And there are, again, more projects coming up. We're doing a backyard renovation over the few months. And so click the subscribe button if you want to see more videos chronicling how we're trying to revamp, refurbish, renew this place where we are living. And uh, otherwise, have a great day.